driving right through was Daylon Frontier. Many Lee had a good start. Royal Majesty, all American Ingot is up on the far outside. Truth to Life is driving in from fifth position. Moving along the inside was Umbro Road, third to last. He's just ahead of Green Tail Vogel and Red River Hanover was last away on the outside. All American Ingot parks to the first turn at the flank of Daylon Frontier. Royal Majesty, Mini Me is on the outside. The opening quarter was battled out through a steady rain in 26 and 4. Campbell made the front with All American Ingot into the Woodbine backstretch. Daylon Frontier hugs that pocket tight from second. Mini Me is still out there almost all the way to the half. Royal Majesty by two more legs back and forth. Red River Hanover is making his move. He's fifth on the outside and driving hard. Then Truth to Life, Umbro Wave, and Dream Favor go trailed. Mini Me, the new leader over All American Ingot. Caught to the outside. Red River Hanover in 55 and 1. All American Ingot is off stride. Mini Me is all alone on the lead. Now stalking in. Here comes Red River Hanover. Game on Frontier along the inside. Truth to Life is up into the top four. Royal Majesty outside fifth. Then it's back to Dream Favor Vogel. Umbro Wave. All American Ingot made a break in the back stretch and is out of contention. They move over to the three quarters. Red River Hanover is up to stare. Mini Me in the eye at the head of the lane. Then Daylon Frontier and Truth to Life. 123 and 1. Three quarter time. Red River Hanover. Mini Me have had a long battle. They enter the final eighth of the mile. Red River Hanover hits the front for Luke Ouellette and he's not urging at all. That's Red River Hanover in the first Pepsi North America Cup elimination. Red River Hanover driving off. Impressive winner. Mini Me stays for second. May have been close though. Royal Majesty right there. Then Daylon Frontier. Red River Hanover. 151 and 3. Place photo in the fourth race.